Hey everyone, I am Damian Holbrook from TV Guide Magazine and TV Insider, and I am here with the crew from Judy Justice on IMDb TV. Court is back in session. So we have Sarah Rose, who is our law clerk. We have Whitney Kumar, who is our stenographer, and we have Kevin Rasko, our bailiff. So you guys, this is very exciting. Um, let me just start with, with Whitney first. How did you get involved in this show? Well, you know what? The show actually found me. <laughs> and so I've been a, a stenographer for quite some time now. And so through that time, I've built a network and, and the producers found me through that network. Someone gave him my name and I got a call one day from a producer and said, hey, how would you like to do this show with Judge Judy? And I said, heck yeah, <laughs> that sounds really cool. So here I am. All right. What about you, Kevin? Well, I was working with uh, Judge Judy uh, for about three and a half, three to four years working with her already as a bodyguard. And uh, one of the producers told me that they were going to have a new show. And what I would you be interested in? I was like, sure. So I was already in the, in the family. <laughs> I, speaking of being in the family, Sarah, this is your grandmother's show. Um, yeah. I, did you have to try out? How did you end up here? Um, it's a funny story. You know, my grandmother and I are very close. So we spent the first three or four months of COVID together, just quarantining in Florida. And that's when this whole sort of new show came about. And she said, I have this new exciting show. We're adding a law clerk and eat over breakfast. I said, that sounds great. Sounds like it's going to be a great, successful show. And she said, I'm glad you think so, because it's you. <laughs> so that's that's how I found out in the middle of COVID. Um, and it was really great. I'm excited to be a part of it. And now, Whitney, you know, Sarah has met the host. Um, what was your what was your first meeting with Judy like? Uh, you know, I'm not gonna lie, I was a little nervous. I didn't know what to expect. And uh, you know what? And it's funny because she is she is a lot like what you expect, but also very different. And she's really, really compassionate and kind, like this great leader in the cases and off the set. And and honestly, she made us feel so comfortable. All right, all of our first first time ever doing anything like this and I remember she walked out and she kind of got us all laughing and moving and we were like okay now we can do this and uh so she's been so fun to work with Kevin you you know you've worked as a bodyguard so with you being the bodyguard is there a specific like training or certification you have to go through to become a bailiff no you know you know I have history uh I come from a law enforcement background I'm a retired uh, Los Angeles uh, probation officer. So working with the juvenile high risk kids. So it was familiar with the procedures and just became second nature. And Sarah, how different is your grandmother outside of the courtroom? Like, is there a judge version of her versus like a home version? What you see is pretty much what you get <laughs> with her. I mean, obviously she can be softer than what she presents on the show at home. And she is just so caring and loving with the entire family. Just even just dinners that we have with all of us. She's not, you know, yelling and <laughs> trying to teach us all a lesson. But there's always that little thread of, right. of uh, the Judy you see on TV, even at our home dinners and things like that. But pretty much what you see is what you get with her. So. And what do you call her? Like on the job. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's been pretty tricky to catch myself, <laughs> Nana, Judy. I don't want to disrespect her and call her Judy, but you know, a judge. Um, I really just go, hey, <laughs> and, and try and get her attention that way. Um, right. I have to figure something out. It's getting too late in the game to not have a go to um, yeah. something yeah. to call her. <laughs> I've heard little well, slip you call her Nana. I'm like, <laughs> Thank you guys so much. I am super excited about this. And everyone, don't forget Judy Justice on IMDb TV.